Screenshot It is an application that lets you take screenshots of anything on your phone. To take a screenshot, all you have to do is hit the Take Screenshot button. Within a few seconds, a box pops up that gives you three options. You can save the screenshot, you can share the screenshot, or you can crop the screenshot. Let's crop the screenshot. Resize the crop box and hit the crop button. Now we're left with two options. We can save the screenshot to our phone or we can share the screenshot with our friends. Let's share the screenshot and in this case I'm simply going to email the screenshot to myself. Within a few seconds that screenshot is in my email inbox as an attachment. I can also take a screenshot simply by pulling down the notification bar and hitting the take a screenshot button. Again a box will pop up after the screenshot has been taken that will give me three options. Let's save the screenshot. It goes into my photo gallery. Also in my gallery you can see there's a collection of other screenshots that I've taken previously. In some cases, it's difficult to take a screenshot because the notification bar is not available. For example, in my favorite game, Angry Birds, the game takes up the full screen, so there's no notification bar from which I can initiate the screenshot. I want to take a screenshot of all the levels that I've completed, which is not very much. I can actually take a screenshot by holding down the search button for a couple seconds. Once I do that, a menu pops up, and if I select the screenshot it icon, a screenshot will be taken. Again, the three options come up, and let's crop the screenshot. I want to crop the part that's interesting to me. Hit crop. And now let's MMS it to myself. I'm taken to the MMS screen with the screenshot, the crop screenshot shot attached, and I can write a message and send it to whoever I want. There are a variety of options with screenshot it. I can set a delay that tells the application how many seconds to wait after initiating a screenshot to actually take that screenshot. I can also optionally enable a setting that lets me shake the phone to take a screenshot. I have a choice between two different image formats, PNG or JPEG. And on some phones, screenshot may turn out flipped, rotated, or with funky colors, and there are a variety of options to compensate for that. Finally, I can adjust the directory on which uh, to save the screenshot. If you're still confused, there's a pretty good tutorial that tells you step by step on how to take a screenshot. That's all there is to it. I hope you enjoy the application.